Peter Elzinga. It's the first appearance for Peter Rutt for Mr. Dos Santos here at the European Grand Prix in Italia. For Peter Elzinga, he's a many-time veteran of this event, but his highest finish so far has been fourth. He is certain to finish higher than that today. And please welcome the coaches from Brazil and Netherlands onto the field of play. On target number two, shooting for Brazil, it'll be Roberval dos Santos. And shooting on target number one, it'll be Peter Elzinga of Netherlands. Mr. Dos Santos will be shooting first on target number two as we're about to begin the gold medal match. Ten points. High score. Ten. Ten, ten, ten. Perfect score. Ten, ten, ten. Top score after the first three hours. I charge for shooting perfect scores. Ladies and gentlemen, sponsors of the 2006 Medixon Archery World Cup include Medixon System, Kia Motors, Turkish Airlines, Swiss Timing, and Balmain Swiss Watches. Please turn off your mobile phones and we remind you this is a non-smoking event. No smoking permitted. Official scores are on the board. Each archer with 30 points. Tied score, so we go back to the original shooting order as Mr. Dos Santos of Brazil comes to full draw. 10X. Four tens in a row. Perfect 
score after five errors from both of these archers. Sixty points, ten, ten, ten. Just out of the town. What a duel. With the halfway mark, only six arrows to go, each archer shooting nearly perfectly. Perfect score from Mr. Dos Santos of Brazil. And an almost perfect score, just a millimeter and a half, two millimeters out for that last arrow from Peter Elzinga. Mr. Elzinga will be shooting first. If you look at the windsock on the big screen, you can see the conditions are almost ideal for a competition right now. Very light winds. So the archers have to worry only about their own situation, aiming and executing their shot. Official scores are on the board. Peter Elzinga of Netherlands will lead off in this next end. We're at the halfway mark in this 12-arrow gold medal match. And you can see why these archers are here shooting for the gold medal. Ten. Nine. Tied score. points for Peter Elzinga of Netherlands. Ten. Ten points. With three arrows remaining unofficially on the board, Robert Dos Santos of Brazil has a one-point lead going into the final three arrows. Peter Elzinga will start off as we continue. of Brazil, but it's Mr. Dos Santos who is just a little better so far. He's got more one-point advantage. It's the final three years. Mr. Elzinga shooting first. Ten X. Nine. Tied score. Two arrows to go.
nine. Nine, tied score, and this match is going to a shootout. With 117 points from each of these archers, the highest scores that have been shot so far in the last few days. We'll be going into overtime, going into a shootout. That'll be coming up in just a few moments. is supposed to shoot first. The second arrow of the tiebreaker. Once again, Mr. Dos Santos of Brazil will be shooting first on target two. too close for me to be able to really say. The judges really are going to have to pull out the magnifying glass on this one. It does look like Mr. Dos Santos is a small amount closer to the center. Judges have been known to just call it a wash in this kind of a situation and uh, make it go to a fourth arrow. We've seen that happen two times in the Olympic Games but not so far in one of these Grand Prix events. We'll see what happens when the judges pull out the counters. It's looking for Mr. Dos 
Santos has a pretty good chance of having won this day. It looks as if he's got about a one arrow diameter difference. The judge will let us know in a second.